Ellsworth, the man of the hour, Jackson Moy. Jackson, kind of take me through, uh, you know, kind of your decision. What what made Tennessee right for you? Um, just going through the process, I wanted to be a part of a explosive defense um, with a lot of defensive line production. I'm going into a program where I know I'm going to have to compete, um, and there's no better uh, conference to do that in the SEC. So I'm just really excited to be a part of it and uh, get to work. Coach Chop uh, was instrumental. Coach Garner as well. Um, what did you like about that combo? Um, I just say how how much they wanted me and how much they showed that I was a priority um, throughout my recruiting, my short recruiting process. And um, Coach Garner's resume obviously speaks for itself. Some of my favorite players of all time, um, Justin Houston. Um, so just when I saw the players that he's coached and his track record, uh, along with Coach Chop, um, and them, their journey together, um, it's hard to beat. When they first reached out, I'm not sure you really envisioned yourself coming east, and yet <laughs> here you are now. Like, it kind of take me through that, that kind of, you know, like, I don't really want to do that, and eh, maybe yeah. I want to go check it out, and now you're here. Yeah, so Coach Chop had originally called me um, saying, uh, are you interested in the University of Tennessee? And uh, at the time, I was... I packed up my things from Stanford and I was on my drive home from to Southern California. So I was a little emotional and I I said, Oh coach, I don't I don't want to waste anybody's time and so he's like, Oh, I understand But then I gave myself an hour to think and I was like, That was Tennessee calling you and so I called him and I said, Oh, actually coach, um, you know, I am really interested. I think I was just making an emotional decision right there, so um, you know, we got to talking and now now I'm here. Got the Polynesian artwork here. Uh, you know, Jackson is Polynesian. Tennessee's had a pretty good Polynesian defensive lineman uh, in Jesse Mahalona, you know, yeah. about 20 years ago or so. Uh, you know, and he was an All-American. He had picture hangs in the football complex over there. They've had all the Polynesians, um, whether it be JT Mapu, another good defense, uh, defensive lineman, uh, Albert Tolina, and of course, obviously, Nico Iamaliava. So they have a little bit of Polynesian culture here in the South. Uh, it's not new. So kind of like, does yeah. that does that kind of give you peace of mind too? Do you? There's been guys that have come come in that same path. Oh, definitely. Um, and a big reason I I could just feel all the love of you know the Tennessee fans and their love and excitement to embrace my culture and just seeing how they embrace other former Polynesian players that um, started here. Just to see their love for my culture, it it's exciting to be a part of a new and a new culture embrace um, Tennessee and you know try to get a poly pipeline going out here. So, what do you bring to the table for Tennessee fans that haven't seen you play at Stanford? What, what do you What do you bring? Uh, I say I'm a very versatile defensive lineman. Um, very quick, relentless to the ball, um, high energy guy, uh, big locker room guy, friendly dude off, on the, off the field. But when I get on the field, I like to turn that switch. Um, just really excited to show the fans that. I'm capable of, and I know it's going to be a lot of hard work, but I'm excited for the task. You're from San Diego. They don't get snow in San Diego, and the uh, weekend you show up, it snows more, <laughs> more than it snowed in near 30 years. Uh, yeah. Kind of thoughts on just kind of saying, hey, it's a little different. Just don't get used yeah. to anything go snow like that. You're <laughs> uh, It was honestly pretty cool. I, I, I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, my, my mom and my dad were throwing snowballs at me, so it was it was a cool experience, and Everyone's told me this is like super rare too. It so, is. Um, I I didn't mind it, so I, I had a good. It was a good a good time for me. All right, Tennessee's newest football commitment, Jackson Moy. Jackson gets enrolled this week, and he'll start classes, and he'll be here for spring practice. Yes, sir. Thank you.